when I was a kid, uh, I was at my uncle's house. It was me and my sister Nicole. We were uh, sleeping on the couch, and uh, it was a really spooky house. There's been paranormal, panor paranormal, paranormal activities taking place there before. So I'm a little kid, and I'm hearing somebody like literally right next to me on the coffee table eating something. I was too scared to uh, open my eyes, but I just heard somebody going, mm, "Yummy, yummy, yummy, yummy." And you know, I'm a little kid. I'm not open my eyes. I'm scared. And in the morning. My uncle's cigarette pack was all crumbled up. All the cigarettes were all broken up and tobacco was everywhere. So I don't know what happened, but something happened and uh, that'd probably be my scariest moment. So I do see spirits. I mean, I don't believe in the whole witchcraft thing. Well, I do, but not, I don't practice it. I'm a Christian, but I definitely do see demons and spirits. Like, um, I guess that's a little gift that I have. And I can sometimes see things in my dreams before it happens, sort of like. Um, I used to be afraid of the dark. I still kind of am, but I mean, this is a shoe. Everybody's gonna be around, so I'm all for it. And I'm, I'm here with like cool people. You know, I feel like all of us have gotten pretty close and I'm ready for the challenge of shooting in the dark as well as spending the night in what looks like a haunted, haunted freaking cabin. I'm not scared of ghosts or anything like that. That was a kid thing. I could walk into the cabin right now, pitch black. I'm not scared of anything being in there. You know, I'm, that's not what I'm scared of. But uh, I would say just letting my family down, you know? You know how you've kind of had like repeating dreams that kind of are like scary repeating dreams? Well, like my dream is um, not being able to have a voice and then being captured by someone in the dark. And so like, I guess I don't like being um, in control and not having a voice.